In this city in Russia's south, not far from the Ukrainian border, residents awoke to rebel mercenary fighters standing guard on street corners. The scene tense but unusually calm as Wagner forces seized power in rostov and don without firing a single shot. And their boss called for a rebellion against Russia's army. Will there be a civil war, a civilian onlooker asks. Everything will be fine, this fighter responds. The Wagner paramilitary group, led by Evgeny Prigozhin, has fought the bloodiest battles alongside the regular Russian military in Ukraine. On Saturday, Prigozhin vowed to oust the military leadership. And threatened to move on to Moscow if the country's defense minister and top general did not meet with him. Armored convoys seen here heading north on the road toward Moscow, including a flatbed truck carrying a tank. Mama! 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 While videos showed signs of active fighting in a city more than halfway to the capital. But hours after President Vladimir Putin promised to stop the rebellion, he called a stab in the back. Prigozhin ordered his troops to turn around to avoid shedding Russian blood. The announcement came amid claims of a deal brokered by the Belarusian government. Prigozhin blames the Ministry of Defense for botching the war in Ukraine, where overnight the Russians launched one of their biggest missile barrages in weeks. But even as turmoil unfolded in Russia, experts say it would lead to no significant changes on the battlefield. Over the longer term, even if there were to be a significant change in who directs military policy within Russia, their aims would remain the same. Prigozhin says his forces came within 200 kilometers of Moscow before the sudden retreat. Now this brief but remarkable rebellion touched off international concern, with G7 foreign ministers, including Melanie Jolie, getting on the phone to discuss what had been an unpredictable moment in history. In Russia, Recruitment banners for the Wagner Group were seen being taken down from billboards. What remains uncertain at this point is how Putin ultimately deals with Prigozhin in the aftermath of what had been such a direct challenge to his authority within his own borders. For City News, I'm Karen Siolin.